you know i was born hey guys welcome back to the channel this is the yoga man channel if you're new here please subscribe and don't forget to turn on notifications so today i'm reacting mm -hmm. to this speech that has been given by the american actor terence howard to the president of uganda now terence howard and his wife are in uganda uh, on what we thought was actually uh, maybe a vacation time or something like that. But it turns out he's actually in Uganda to look for support in what he calls his new discovery, his new technology that he wants to actually deploy in Uganda and start doing tests here. He talks about hydrogen <clears throat> and how he has actually uh, found a formula for hydrogen flights. Now, I don't want to speak a lot about what he's saying, but I want us to listen word by word what he's saying. And then I also want us to observe the body language, his body language and the people around him, especially the point where the wife listens to what he's saying and she just can't believe it. Now, many African countries have actually faced a challenge where renowned people come and fleece the local people. And it's very, very disturbing when it comes to that. But, but I'm not saying Terrence Howard is actually trying to also plan a deal to scam Ugandans. But it's not something that cannot happen. I want you to listen to this, and I'll tell you why. I'm Terrence Deshaun Howard. I've become an actor. You know, I've been nominated for Oscars and Golden Globes and, and SAG Awards. But those weren't the things that really moved me. As a child, I studied chemical engineering at Pratt Institute. was there for two years until I saw that there was an inconsistency. So, first of all, he said he studied chemical engineering for two years, meaning he actually might not have finished. Okay? He saw something was inconsistent, but let's go ahead. With the math there. And so I went out to explore a new way of understanding how the universe worked, and I was able to define the grand unified field equation they've been looking for and put it into geometry. And then with that geometry, I was able to put props on that. And what I'm saying is now we have invented a new... F Do you guys look at the reaction on his wife's face? Just look at that reaction, guys. Just, I mean, we listening to his speech and we're trying to analyze it. ...form a flight that I would like to bring here to Uganda to replace the drones, to replace the helicopters, to replace the planes. He's already saying to replace the drones, to replace the helicopters, something he has not actually yet started, but he really wants to replace things. We've already... Sounds you know, I was born Terrence Deshaun Howard. I've become an actor. Okay, so I'll have to run it forward so that we can actually start from... Ganda, to replace the drones, to replace the helicopters, to replace the planes... We've already, we have all the funding necessary. Well, we have all the funding necessary. Okay. <clears throat> I want you to listen to that. We have all the funding necessary. Meaning if you have the funding, you can still find grounds where this project can actually be launched until it is ready to go out to other countries and maybe for people to trade in it. Okay we need is just a fertile ground in which to build this. Now, this is the geometry of hydrogen. Of? Of hydrogen. Hyd okay, mm -hmm. so the president asks, this is the geometry of hydrogen, Howard says, and then the president is like, of, he repeats to say, of hydrogen. hydrogen. This is the proton itself. Mm. So any bond... Immediately, he goes on to say, this is the proton itself, okay? He seems to be speaking in a language that somehow is tailored to be complicated to understand, but he's speaking to the president, so let's wait. That hydrogen can make, our linchpins are able to make. So we're talking about unlimited bonding 
unlimited predictable structures, supersymmetry, and the linchpins are now able to be. Do you see his body language? That body language is very, very suspicious. But anyway, Terence Howard is an actor. Don't be shocked that this turns out to be a scam, but he has acted it out well. Okay, so we we just gonna let's just see um, how he finishes off. The linchpins are now able to behave as a swarm, as a colony that can defend the nation, that can harvest food, that can remove plastics from the. He mentions defend a nation. Remember how president is very, very interested in the political things and most importantly, security. The ocean that can give the children of Uganda and the people of Uganda an opportunity to spread this and to sell these products throughout the world. So we are no longer just selling agricultural products and pieces from the land. We can now sell and take. Our president looks convinced. By the look on his face, he seems to be convinced. Okay, so let's just go back. We can now sell and take center stage with technology, but the main purpose is for to defend the sovereignty of a peaceful place and a peaceful people without having to have our young men lose their lives. To defend the sovereignty of a peaceful place and a peaceful people without having young people lose their lives. This sounds a political statement, which I know <clears throat> has been revised and put into consideration. Let's not deep dive so much into why this is going on. This is not the first time this happens in Africa. So many of these guys from, you know, America, Europe have moved to many African countries and duped them. And I'm not saying Terence Howard is going to do the same, but I mean, once beaten, twice shy, um, it's, it's not something that will be shocked if it turns out to be a scam. Especially, I don't believe the statement when he says, this technology that will protect a sovereign state of peaceful people. Um, you know, this sounds more political. But let's go, let's see how this goes. I am very skeptical that this is real. I am very skeptical that this is real. But like I said, and I'm not saying that Terrence Howard is here in Uganda to do something that is not real. All I'm saying is I am very skeptical. I'll see you guys again in the next video. Tell me what you think. Tell me what you think, where you are. If this has happened in your country or you've had someone, you know, come promise you heaven on earth and it doesn't happen, go ahead, make it a comment and I'll be reading all your comments. Cheers, guys. I'll see you again on the next video.